it, we're on, we're recording. Like, put it in, put it in, right? Home Street Square, right? You know how we do. Hey, man, don't go hide it. They're coming in, man. So, with this whole shooting thing and all that, it's like, what do we do? What do we do? So, I said something constructed to somebody yesterday asking the same question, what do you do? I'm like, okay, if you stay signed, you can kill a fish. Second Amendment got your back, right? Yeah. Okay. Something appeared on social media. This is the advent of social media. Flip side of it. You got a brother teaching his children how to disarm blocks, 9mm, and I think a heckler and cuts. Three guns. But how to take them apart to get game and shoot straight. Because you know, most Negroes don't know how to shoot straight. Very <laughs> well. So, if the brother now with the wife you should learn how to use firearms also. Responsibility and constructive, uh, productive, positive. So you're out with your family, right? You're driving on the highway, the freeway, whatever, going about your business. Now, I shouldn't say driving, you're traveling too. Definition of driving means you're submitting to this corporation, which backs up my point that the UK and the US are corporations and never been countries, they're not countries, right? So driving is different from traveling. I would travel with my freedom. So the brother is asked by the so called law enforcement to produce his work, his driver's license. We're not really obliged to show anything, driver's license. Like, if I'm, if, if, if I'm being questioned to show my driver's license, so a so called officer of the law, and I'm not under the constraints of wrong, what the fuck looks wrong about me? I definitely, I'm not romantic, I'm a lover. But I'm not romantic, you know what I'm saying when I say romantic? Yeah, yeah, romantic are. is the antics of Rome. I'm not under the codes of Rome, so I don't fall under their bullshit ID, especially fucking IC3 and whatever. So, <laughs> back to the point. So, they're pulling me up, saying, you know, towel light, which I've had before, right? Bear with me, I got this, right? So, they're pulling me up, saying, you know, I'm driving. I'm like, well, first of all, so I'm not driving. I'm traveling. And for traveling, I do not need a license. Because I'm, I'm a free man. I don't mean freedom of the law. I'm talking before this Morris bullshit. I'm not saying Morris science is bullshit. Big respect to Nova Jolie, 912, know that. I know my stuff, you know that. So, what I'm saying is that, uh, yeah, so I'm traveling. So if I'm in the vehicle, and you know, I, you know, the boy Brooklyn the bar drives big jeeps, four by fours, I've run out of cars a long time ago. Right, so if I'm traveling with my family, right, and the children know, respectively, how to use firearms, and they perceive a threat, because remember, Hotep, the officer says, why did they shoot us? Because the officer perceives a threat to his personal life, right? Although he's got bulletproof vests, and with all his details, security detail, you, you know, you're, you're trained to shoot to me. Not really shoot to take the brother's head off, or put five bits of lead in your, in your head and shit, in front of somebody's woman, you know what I'm saying? So, you should be trained to shoot to me. So, if my wife, who I'm traveling with, or my children in the back, who I'm traveling with, not driving, traveling with, perceive a threat to my life, then I would want them to shoot a cup before the cup shoots me. And that's not me saying or advocating Brooklyn New Bar is not saying go out and shoot cups. Alright? I ain't nothing to do with that sniper shit, you know what I mean? I don't live in Texas. You know? But I'm saying, right? You know how I get down. If my children perceive a threat to me or the wife I'm with at the time, then shoot before the cups shoot me and the wife. Or if the wife perceives it and her hands nearer to the gun than mine. I'm trying to go for my so-called driving license, but I'm really traveling. I shouldn't need to produce anything to the officer. Because I don't recognize the jurisdiction over me anyway. I'm not part of this um, corporation. I ain't signed no fucking contract because I know my shit. I know how to stand in my circle on my square. But at this precise time, I'm traveling, right? But you still pull me up for some bullshit on a tower like, You know, you could have hollered it through that microphone when I would have complied with you. But you want to be extra, extra swatch me, bro. Yep. So. If my wife shoots, look, my brother Tupac done it. What, what happened? He perceived that the cops, he perceived that uh, his life was in danger. That's what the cops do. What do you do? He shot back at the cops. You dig me? So, if my life is in danger, my wife sees that, shoot the cop before I get taken out. The children think that me and the wife are in danger. Shoot the cops before we both get taken out and you're a water state. But your child's a water state anyway. But that's a whole other story and a whole other story. <laughs> so I'm not advocating go out and shoot cops. I'm saying like self-defense is no offense. And that's the real. You know what I'm saying? And you know what's ironic? 
I'm going to bring the good brother Idris in here because I want some feedback from the good brother. No, 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 no. He's well learned though, even if you get his voice, man. Very well learned. So he knows the technology of the media. You don't understand the technology you go back to Peter Toss back in the 80s. You know, Peter Toss told us that technology, right? Nothing's good said, nothing's good said. No, I won't be a camera. To so my point, to my point, to my point. And you're, you're going to agree, right? Or you might not agree. That's your problem, right? Because, you know, Chris Cross is... But anyway, right? What I'm saying is that uh, I don't lose my channel of thought, right? Yeah, yeah. Check the media. Out of all the pictures they had homeboy, you know, yeah. Sniper. Yes. Out of all the pictures. The hero. This is one they chose. The one with the Sheiky. The Sheiky, yeah. yeah. And the fist. That's right, yeah. But why, so, not, why not the whole US military uniform right. be this served in yeah. Afghanistan? I yeah. know people serve. Because we can't discredit the US uniform. But, however. Yeah. It's a message. The Dushinki. So now people now have Black. a correlation between the Dushinki, which you can buy in those in the market, yeah. five bucks, or Brixton, or Hansen, yeah. or anywhere. You can buy them in the market. And a lot of girls are wearing it. It looks nice. You know, at least they're trying to connect to the motherland. Black there ain't Black. no slave babies. Yeah. But now, what Europeans or certain people out here, and Kings especially, are going to do, you know, the Kings are sell out. What they're going to do is have the correlation that Dushinki equals terrorist equals. That's right. Equals cop killer. Black equals revolutionary. I see cop killer. Yeah. And I, I will do said, Black power doesn't mean anti anything else. You know what I'm saying? Because ironically, you all know Europeans support me more than most of your black coons. So <laughs> then they're, they're my it's number one power. sellers, and yeah. I'm selling look. Like, look. Black look. Black power. And you're getting black power. Black power doesn't mean anti white. Black power doesn't mean anti anything else. Like they know anybody else. Asian or anything. You dig me? And racism. Racism is always being financial. Racism doesn't mean black and white. Because you're going to add something to the word racism. Now, if you're talking black, so called black and white racism, because we're not black and they're not white. We know that. So, if you're talking like people of color, which we are, and people who like color, which they are, then you're talking white, you're talking racism, white supremacy. You have to add the conversation to it. Racism, white supremacy, which is really financial, almost uh, municipal, again. You know what I'm saying? So racism is not anti anything else, it's just self preservation. First law of nature. And we are nature by nature. And I was nurtured by nature. Natural nature. But some of y'all cool don't get what I'm saying. You heard me? <laughs> I ain't even playing like that. So, if everyone just takes their time, there's a lot of protests going on right today. Protests don't get you nowhere. Where, where the heck is protest ever gone? Come on in. Speak on it, my brother. Yeah, well, I'm not protesting such, but I know protesters get you just that little time for them to organise and structure how they're going to make us move forward. Not how we want to move forward, how they want to make us move forward. And people take the job and they'll be head of the organisation. And That's job it. is, remember, just above broke. Yeah. So let me spin that back here, right? So the 60s and whatever. So, dudes in the hood, protest, civil rights. But hold on. I'm your civilian. What are you protesting for? It doesn't make no sense. You're a civilian already, right? Yeah, so you should be protesting for your civil rights. Because you're a civilian. Citizen of the country. Uh, unless you're not. And you're protesting for human rights. But I'm humane. I'm, I'm a human, human. man. Yeah. 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 Okay. So, hotel. You good? So, why are you protesting? Like, you're doing a discredit to all those came before man. you. You're doing a discredit to, to my man, uh, Frederick Douglass. Marcus Garvey? Oh, great educator. You see what I'm saying? To everybody. To everybody. And as you hear me, I, I, I say it a lot and I don't miss my words. Like, so you're saying we're like in human rights? Because who is it? As in a Hugh oh, man. Okay, I stand to be correct. Like Which color. I say, right? Yeah. <laughs> so Hugh is amounting something. Now, what I'm saying is because if they recognize you as a human being, yeah. then you will need to be protesting for your civil rights. Exactly, because it will come naturally. If okay. you're, if you're of, of nature, and I have done told you, yes, sir. I was nurtured by nature. Right. So I'm natural nature. I hear that. So I don't recognize, you know me, I don't yeah, recognize yeah. I don't recognize boroughs. No. I don't recognize cities. Yeah. I don't recognize districts, yeah. shire districts, shire counties, and countries. Yeah. Because I know it's all fictitious. Right. I know they pour the wool over people's eyes. Yeah. I know that the United Kingdom is not a country. It's yeah. trades on a stock exchange. Therefore, it's a corporation. And you know for, for a fact that the United States is not a country. It trades on a stock exchange. Therefore, it's a corporation. So they right. apply certain offices to protect what? The corporation. Corporation, yes. Serve, protect, or snap a nigga's neck. Sounds like a business to me. Exactly, it's a business. And if you don't comply with the business, what happens? They chop you out. What they do? They put sanctions in your ass, right? If yeah, you don't agree do, yeah. Yeah. with the United Nations who came together, United Nations, which they're prerogative, okay, because they trade. Because remember, their business is in corporations. So corporations trade. Yeah. That's what they do. Yeah. But if you don't agree with their trade, 
damn bound to your ass. Oh. For, you're for fit. Exactly. For boots. Exactly. To survive. Exactly. So as an individual who doesn't know knowledge of self, what have you done in an instant? You surrendered your divinity. You've been, mm. So you're bowing down. But these other people now, right. when you go on the advent of social media, what are they saying about this week? You know what they're saying? You know what they're saying. They're saying, Sunday, tomorrow, we're going to go somewhere, and we're going to pray. You, you're going too fast. Are you referring to over here or in America? I'm talking about over Where? here and America, because oh. this is America, remember? But we've been this Prince Britannia, oh. Elizabeth Bitch, gave okay. birth to America. This is what you did me, right? When you say they're going to go pray, they're going to pray. But Every we, time something happens, but we've been prayed, pray. But we've been prayed upon. And what does it bring us? Oh, shit. Can you please repeat that again? We've been prayed upon over and over again. We've been, been prayed, upon, prayed like, upon. Yeah, like a carcass. Right. Like, you know, like an animal would prey upon a livestock. Instead of being like the praying mantis right. and bringing that self defense to the weapons, yeah. we allow ourselves to be prayed, prayed. upon. Yeah. Like wolves, right? Okay. So we're asking for more of course. disaster. Exactly. We're inviting more <laughs> shit. Exactly. Technology. Where's the, where's the rest of the time? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, where is, yeah, technology. Peter Tosh, man. Technology and politics. They get us all tricked. You think me? I had some sister come in here earlier talking about how uh, how Obama's been great. Great and, I, I, and, and, I, and, great. and he's done many things. Guess what? You don't mind us, but yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. naming nine things that he's done was great. What else is he doing? Hear the sister. Uh, Suddenly said a folk, a fucking a folk. I said, yo, let me make it, let me make it simple. Let me talk English. You know, because I talk the worst spoken English. But he did mention change. Yeah. He's no. Said, okay, but change is the only constant thing. So that's oh, self. Oh, that's oh, yeah. always gonna be here anyway, okay. right? So I've got you. Yes, sir. So, so I said to her, I goes, okay. Instead of nine things that Obama has done, um, allegedly or reportedly, I said, okay, name me one. And she was like, uh, uh, Obamacare. I go, yeah. Obama, get the fuck out of here. Niggas, please. Obamacare. It's just sugar coating, Medicare, something that was already there. Yes. It was already there. Look, white rice was always there. That's and then right. it was a poison. Yeah. What did, what did Uncle Ben do? He sugar coated it with caramel. Yeah. yeah. Brown rice. Yeah. It's Thank the same you. poison. Okay. It's two different <laughs> it's two different extremes of the same yeah. polarity. It's still rice. Yeah. It's still gonna fuck you up. Unless you have to, unless you learn to consume wild rice. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like when I ask you dude, what's the difference between hot and cold water? And a dude is there like thinking about that. The mere, the mere thing that you're thinking about it shows you don't know. Mm. They tricked you. Yeah, There's yeah. no difference between hot and cold water. It's two different compositions of the same polarity. Period. I know. I know. But the, the mere fact you're thinking about it, we don't use the thing. Cold. 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 Exactly. Right now, hey, you're going to say to them, boy, it's hot, boy. Yeah, yeah. It's hot, boy. So the child got beat that is hot. So they're confused, right? <laughs> but check it, they're confused. So yeah. they're different, different in between. Remember, it's the whole sugar and salt combination. Mm. How they got you trapped. Every single food you you, co you consume, which you know is a drug, yeah. being taken out of natural habitat, which that definition is a drug. Right. Yeah. If you go to the movie house, you have popcorn, what's the choice? You can have a sweet popcorn, which is sugar, or you can have salted. Sour. Salted. Yeah. Well, they say you're salted, right? Yeah, yeah. Salted. Oh, so yeah, yeah. So you're trapped in between. Yeah. You're different, 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 different. And that's how they got everybody trapped in between. Instead of either your personal equilibrium, your equal yeah. balance. Equilibrium. That ma'at that draws you inside of you. Yes. They do yes. have that now. Sweet and sour. Yeah. Sweet salted, and sour. salted and sweet at the same time. Yeah, but yeah. they purport it to be like that. But what's preserving those potato chips? What if I told you that there's so. baby feeders and rat feeders and and ah oh man. Bring that dog break down. And all that. Put it there. Yeah. Put it there so you say how long this mistake before it breaks down. Can I say something? You know there's Go a ahead. mass deployment of European and American troops. During this uh, issue that's taking place in America, America and Britain and Europe have deployed mass troops along the uh, border of Russia, Poland. Yep, see that. Within the last two, three days. And now, and now they're yeah. saying, yeah. and now they're saying that uh, Russia is not pleased. But you know, they're all the same yeah. thing. Yeah. You know, yeah, USSR. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've done this since yeah. 1917. Yeah. I don't, I don't want to distract you. Let's, rid of let's, let's go in. <laughs> let's go in. USSR stands for? Um, you. You, no, Union Soviet Socialist Republic. And also United States of Soviet. Oh, yes. Yeah, right. right, so it's all one land, man. Yeah. Follow. Especially because, the space program. Yeah, because they're teaching you that you're in between. Like in the UK, you're in between or whatever. Or in United States, that they're in between, whatever. But hold on a minute. Station. But hold on a minute. Uh, Let's look at the map. United States of Soviet Russia, which is what USSR really is, United States of Soviet Russia, is 14 miles separation. The Bering. The Bering Strait. Alaska. 
how the Indian first came to America. We told you not really, it's not really the Native Americans, we are. Yeah. And they came in peace through dynasty and blended and mixed in with us. Because they walked across the Bering Strait. Kaboom! Right <laughs> but people don't realize in there. So, uh, you can actually, California. you can actually drive, and I mean, you can actually. Yeah. I know that's I thought like, drive as you, as you travel. You can actually travel or drive in your automobile from right. London, England, to New York. You can drive. You can. You know when you say the, the Bering Straits. So you know when you mention the Bering Straits. Yep. That's like saying uh, the coast of Devon to the coast of Calais. Exactly. Frozen, over. But remember, there was always underground tunnels anyway. Before this so-called tunnel, tunnel digging, fuck me, when they mess yeah, with your yeah, brain, yeah, yeah, yeah. there was tunnels there we had from day dot anyway, because we used to come here just yeah, to study. Yeah, yeah. The artifacts up in Scotland, in the, in the <laughs> islands, but they tried to make it a secret, right? Yeah, and they said those yeah, facts yeah. were Scottish facts. Yeah, yeah. But those original Scots were us, me and you. <laughs> those original Yorkshire rights was me and you. Those with your Lancashire rights were me and you. Those wore the roses over me and your blood. They told them the balls. The red and the white balls <laughs> over me and you. Okay, you dig me? So they're just tricking us again. And as a matter of fact, you take it further, if you go to the British Museum, the British Library, and all some of the shit got in the United Kingdom, which is not a country, because the only United Kingdom is a corporation. If you go and check out the whole Shire districts and check out something called the Code of Arms, and look in the Code of Arms and you'll see faces blick. Like purple, like this. Which is not a complexion. This is a complexion. Look, my skin's bunny. That's my name, Luba, Bunny. Of all different shades. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you'll see the Code of Arms of Yorkshire District, Derbyshire, Lancashire, Lanarkshire, all the Shire districts in the so called United Kingdom. You'll see on the coat of Arms the faces of Blick, Maple, Five Past Midnight, Jungle Bunnies, whatever you want to call it. Boom, Nagara. You hear me? You hear me? Naga. But it's just fooling up the people. We used to use this whole place for study. This, this hag, listen. Meadow Nature, right there in Scotland. Meadow Nature, right in the caves of Yorkshire. Skegness, um, Hall, Humberside. The knowledge is there. We use the whole British Isles just to study. Covenant of man, brick, ish. Come on, man. Like, do your work. You know what I'm saying? People are, 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 are tripping. That, yeah, the only pyramids are only in Giza. We put pyramids all over the planet. In the China Sea, there's pyramids bigger than there is on the land. You think? There's glyphs everywhere. As above, so below. Even right now, we're standing in Seven Sisters, and y'all don't realize the fucking significance <laughs> of Seven Sisters. Yeah, the gateway. Y'all don't realize the, the significance. Right. That's why every motherfucker, that's why the Desert Boys want this, this block right here. Yeah, they want yeah. it so bad. They want to race for here like a crusade. But not on my watch. Take that straight. Ain't walking over my ass. Not on my watch. Shit. Home to stand, baby. So come and support your own. You heard me? So, back to the shooting thing. Don't get sad, get mad, but get mad for the correct and right reasons. You dig me? If you live somewhere where guns are legal and lawful, then teach your children and teach your wife to shoot. Because most niggas don't shoot straight. And that can protect their life. I'm not saying God there's shoot cuts, I'm saying just defend yourself. You heard me? There's no law against defending yourself. So preservation. We are nature, natural nature. I'm nurtured by nature. I'm gonna do whatever it takes to survive. But all don't really give a monkey's ass about this human life. Because I'm a light being anyway. You know what I'm saying? Too many of y'all too fucking physical. I ain't about this plane anyway, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna this plane, this plane is shit. This whole history of this so-called planet Earth, what you're called Earth, which is really a water planet anyway. It features this much in galactic news, like this much. And remember, news comes from north, east, west, and south. So seeing that you want to say there's four corners of the earth, what about so-called four corners of the galaxy? Doesn't exist, does it? No. Which is about a universe, like one verse. And that's where I'm from. My message always come from the stars. I ain't talking just the bar band. What are most the soul funk, the jazz, and roller skating, and all that shit, you heard? It's real, man. And you know the way I spell real, and you know my definition of talk. As in energy, everything's energy. You dig me? So all these motherfucking coons talking about, yeah, let's get revenge. Let's, 
What the fuck are you gonna do? You're gonna riot and burn down your whole neighborhood? You ain't learned nothing, have you? You heard me? You're burn down your local labor extreme like the last one of the riots. And when you go to get your government check, you can't get your government check. Why is that? Because you burned down your fucking labor exchange. You have to go three miles, you have to go three miles away to walk from stamp to get your government check. You try to work out, you burnt down your local gym. You tried to put carpet in your mum's crib. What happened? You burnt down carpet land. We were serving the black community for, for years. Remember carpet land? Yeah. You burned it down. So you burned down your neighbor. You ain't learned shit. And the first thing you'll do again, you go downtown to Nike World and you rub some Nikes. What the fuck Nikes gonna do in a riot? Like, why are you rubbing um, um, kale? Like, kale, yeah. Why are you rubbing fucking lettuce and cucumber and watermelons? But as soon as a riot comes, you rub in PC well for a TV for 50 inch inch screen and the revolution ain't gonna be on no TV for you rubbing PC well for a fucking TV. Wake your monk ass up. It's 2016. You gotta be more correct, man. You know what I'm saying? Why are you rubbing like the library? Why did motherfuckers rub um 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 Barnes and Noble in the riot? Why did motherfuckers rub Waterstones? I get some education in Mount Kayan. Instead of rubbing Nike and Adidas, why didn't you rub a bookstore? Like the big bookstores and the British Library. Like, why didn't you go and ransack the library the same way they, they ransacked our biggest library, which is Alexandria? I'm standing here as a physical composition of Alexandra. You dig me? We all meant to be like that, Alexandra. They burnt down Alexandra, but you burned down Carpet World and Dixon's and rub a fucking 40 inch TV. And what makes me laugh about the riots in the UK is that the government was braggadocious about it. I don't blame them, that's their purpose. They said on the news blatantly, every motherfucker who got caught on video in the riots, we're gonna bag them up, we're gonna, burn, we're gonna buddy their ass to the pan, to the youth correctional facilities, to all correctional facilities. We don't care if you're a girl, woman, whatever, they're all going to jail for the shit you've done. And you don't know that the UK, the so-called United Kingdom, Queen Elizabeth bitch, the first and last state of America, Britannia, you don't want the waves, let alone space. So all she rules is microwave, and I ain't about microwaves, I'm about gamma and all that shit. Waves you can't see, because all you niggas can't see me, you fools. Fucking uh, city rabbit. So anyway, back to the point now, is that they promised that they're gonna bag everybody and body everybody. And to this day, guess what they're doing? They're bagging motherfuckers left, right and center, to the jail. Because they got you on video. Why is that? Because United Kingdom is the most, what? CCTV yeah. country on this yeah, so planet. So well, it's not a country, but you know, it's a corporation. Yeah. But the most CCTVs are in this little, okay. this city little right. island of, believe it or not. of 70 million motherfuckers. The most cameras a year. You can't even take a shit without the man knowing. More than the United States. A, imagine that. You can't even poop. Without the man knowing what more you than, wipe your ass with. Wait, more than Canada. More than Germany. Which is Britain again. Okay. Where the Germans are many. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, true, true. it's all good, homie. Yeah. All day, every day. You know how we do. So like, yeah. yeah okay. So, so why is that? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When, listen, when your ass is broke, right? You do like we all do. We go to the dollar store, pound store, and buy right. your bathroom paper, right. right? Get up chicken. But when you got money, you're in Tesco, and you're scared of another person seeing you yeah. if you don't get that Andrix. Because it's being superimposed in your psyche to get the brand name. Get the Andrix. You're getting, you're getting your toothpaste, what do you do? Go for Colgate. You can't be seen in that queue getting anything but Colgate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know Colgate's got pork and sugar in it. Yeah. You're getting rice, Uncle Ben. You know what I'm saying? Uncle Sam, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. But that's all plastic rice. And most of it now is produced in soya. China. Soya rice. Produced in China. And soya, they fucked up a soya bean. Yeah, yeah. So you can't even make soya milk. Right. And even the almond, I'm sorry, yeah. even the almond, they fuck with the almond right now. Because they knew the almond, the, the original almond nut, the seed in the almond, they knew that was uh, anti-cancer. They knew that. Mm. So they fucked with it. So now we can't even make almond milk. You got to go, you got to go and get Brazilian nut and what's the other yeah, I, I, and walnut. Yeah. Make your milk like that. Yeah. Or if you're skilled like me, well I'm not so skilled, but she boy but I'm too saying. You can go get uh, wild rice and extract the juice from that and make yeah. your own uh, rice stream. Right, yeah, what rice cream. Yeah. But in reality, you shouldn't need milk anyway, because if you was on the breasts of your yeah, mother yeah, yeah, for yeah. three, two to three right. years, like you should have been, then there's no substitute. Should because cow's water, milk, so yeah, because cow's milk is for a calf, and goat's milk is for a kid. Mm. And I ain't no goat of Mendes or goat yeah. of, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I ain't no kid, so yeah. Yeah. there you go. So, you know, we're going to learn this shit, this is like real talk. So in a sense, really, we, need own land. Riot, we need our own land. Yeah, who's, who's position the food? Yeah, we need our own land, because those in America, newbies in America, they're getting bigger, bigger, big. If they had their own land, like what Elijah Muhammad like what Elijah Muhammad said, if they had their own land, yeah. four or five hundred people for that. But where is that? That's my question. Like where where is that? Like Nation Islam, like yeah. where's the, the, the ten point plan? Where's the, the, the ten point plan is, is Where's the allotments? Where is it? 
Why is it I get a guy my way in a concrete jungle like London town and educate people on getting a, a, a garden tower? And a garden tower is a, is a tower that will help you grow things even in your crib. I don't care if you live in a 20 inch story of the block of your mom's, you can grow watermelons. Phil Valentine's wife has grown watermelons on a garden tower. <laughs> this is the advice you can put on your window ledge. <laughs> Why isn't people telling you about that? Why isn't people telling you about, okay, I may hate on Tesco, but the, the only good thing about Tesco, I say, you know what? Every now and then, they have a, a steamer in there, a free tier steamer, ceramic, and it'd be like 17 bucks. Go and buy it real quick, get it while it's there. There's, there's a window of opportunity that's allotted to us sometimes and we don't take advantage. Uh, Tesco again, and I hate Tesco, but Tesco again, right, to show that I'm balancing, equilibrium. Tesco again, the other month, they had Bullet in there, Nutra Bullet. They brought it down to like 60 bucks. Get it while it's down, 60 bucks. Because you know, a rabs going to charge you 100 bucks to do some market. Get it while it's there, get it, if, if, if the price goes down, get it. Utilize it. I got two steamers. Yeah, yeah. I tried to have two juices. Get it. But you never see your boy with no fucking microwave. No, 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 I don't no, have no, no, no microwave, that's bad. I'm about to be signed the line, yeah, chemo free in my ass. Let me sign the line, boom. Radiate me on your ass. Oh. Radiate me, fuck that. I ain't trying to be leaving the planet like that. I ain't scared of death, I know death is progressive, you know, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. energy. I just can't disappear, you think? These motherfuckers can't see me, or even you. <laughs> see it, can't see you. Can't see me. Good. But motherfuckers want to wear IC3, they should be an ICU. Yeah. Mm. I see you. I mean, I see you. Who about the ICF though? Uh, that's another story. That's oh, okay. demographics and all that shit. That ain't on the what we're building on right here. Well, they're not there anymore now. They're in Stratford now. Yeah, that's another story, man. Yeah. Which is um, the East End. That, well, the Asians control the East side. Exactly. That's why I hate it, because the energy is wrong. Yeah. Look, when you go into a candy store, right? you're regular candy, candy store, you're a candy. And you go into a candy store, you smell the incense. What does it do to you when you smell that incense? What does it do to you? It turns you off. It turns you off. How does it make you feel? Because you're yeah. kind of dizzy. It's not, it's not it's my serious. frequency. It's serious. Your, right. Yeah. Key word, it's not your yeah. frequency. Yeah. So you don't feel the vibe. So when we burn our incense, it does the same to them. It's not on their vibe. Wow. So it's two opposites. Yeah. But the thing is still adjusting, still. Yeah, yeah. Same but it's thing, coming yeah. from, from two, two different, different polarities. Right. So we're going to do for us and let them do for them. That's yeah. not us hating them. No. Or, you know, if I go into their store and I, I need to buy something, if I really, if it's, I find it's a necessity. You go and get your stuff together. Yeah. But you know what I do, same way I ride the subway chain, what I do, I shallow breathe. <laughs> Motherfuckers think I'm taking a bit, I shallow breathe. Yeah. I shallow breathe. Buy the subway here, I bought a shower. And you know there's no AC on the return line or any other line. You know there's no AC. And you know these motherfuckers don't bathe their skin, right? So you know you're smelling their armpits. You know they're kicking like Bruce Lee. You know they stink. They, man, they stink. You know that. You all ride the train. So you know I'm you know, taking a breath. They stink. And you know you gotta sell a beer. I mean, I don't sit down on the train. Some of y'all do. Yeah, I yeah, respect you, but that's not me, right? I leave you alone. That's what we do. Huh? I stand by the door. Subway car. I stand by the door and get the air. That's the air. Yes, right. Because otherwise you're breathing in the front. Yeah. Right. Life you're breathing in the front. So, so if you're there and the car's going that way and the train's going that way and that motherfucker's there and he sneezes, <laughs> you take the DNA. And please, DNA. Say, please say that again. Like when, he, when he sprays and he sneezes, you're taking in his DNA or her DNA, and that becomes a part of your molecular structure. And right. you wonder why you're fucked up next day when you wake up with a blue bubble, you know, when you turn all that, and you're feeling all off. Then you begin to transform. Exactly. But not like transformers. Right. And that, and right, I'm glad right. you said the word transform because what they're actually doing. Is that they're trying to integrate you yeah. with um, transhumanism. They're trying to oh, integrate you with something. Transhumanism. Transhumanism. Mm -hmm. So they're manipulating your very DNA via your RNA. They're trying to superimpose. Is this super something like social engineering? Right. Trying to superimpose right. GNA, oh. which is glycerol. You know, glycerol is plastic, it's artificial. For one artificial intelligence. One form into another. With form. a nanobite technology. No. Hold it. With a whole nanobite oh. technology. Yeah. You shoot. You yeah. degree. But I think. So, you know, that's how they're trying to run, man. Well, that's what well, they're doing right now. But I see it right now. Oh. But motherfuckers talking about like this technology, like it's all brand new and ain't knows. Nothing new about it. It's around the world. So, you know. Nothing new under the sun. I'm, 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 Vin, keep your eye on the ball. Focus. So, yeah. as we know, all this so-called technology that Carmen is off with, right? Old technology. Yeah, but look, 1963, the original Star Trek, right? Yeah. Yeah. Richard Kirk done what? Beam me up to Scotty, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scott, no. Scott the right game. Oh, you mean like one of these? Flip. And 20 years later, 20 years later, niggas got like model on the plug. So, everything that they're showing you, 
they really go tenfold ahead anyway. So right now, we made that sole cord switch from what? Analog to digital? Yes, right. So now everybody's got flat screen screen, right? Oh, right. No one's got no one's got definition of a TV like you know that big ass bumper Volkswagen shit backside behind a TV. No one's got TV like that no more. There might be some people who live yeah. reclusive. Yeah. <laughs> and the hills and shit. But everyone's got flat TV.